Hi, how y'all doing? It is Monday, the 27th of May, 2024. I think it's the 27th. Yeah, it's the 27th. Today here in Ontario, Canada, it was cloud covered and rained all day. It stopped on and off, but for a short period of time, the pressure was really heavy, right? So, yeah. I learned that uh, when the sky is completely cloud covered all day, it's because there's a mothership above us. So, it resonates with me. It does. I didn't make a video yesterday. I had a good, it started off good, right? It did. I went to the um, holistic fair with my sister and her friend. She was a nice girl, nice woman, right? And, uh, there was like 50 plus vendors, right? Tarot card readers, people sell crystals, all kinds of healing, natural healing modalities. Um, there was a guy from, I don't know, Nepal, selling like singing bowls and gongs and clothing and oh, a bunch of psychics selling their self, right? some like health food like coffee and tea kind of stuff it was quite a bit it was held in a, a hall kind of thing right so i walked around with my sister and her friend not a lot not a lot of walking but a lot of standing right because you have to look at everything it took us about two hours and then we left they went home i came home and about oh two hours later the whole left side of my body seized up cramped up just and as the day progressed, it got worse and worse and worse. It was horrible. It was. All right. I managed to make supper. And then I just could not stop the cramping. It was, it was getting to me. I went to bed. I laid down at around 11. And all night long, every hour, I woke up because my left leg and my right foot both of them cramped up, right? So I have to get up, put pressure on them, you know what I mean? Hold them, push my toes down, all this stuff, trying to get it to loosen so I could go to sleep. I did this all night, like every hour. So around 5 o'clock, 5.30 in the rise, I was like, I'm getting up, I can't take it anymore. This isn't restful, right? So I got up. And after I sat down in my chair for a little while, it calmed down, right? So, but my foot and the leg was still really tight. Then around one, two o'clock, I, I wanted to lay down, right? For I wanted to try to lay down, I'm tired. And uh, so I later thought, okay, maybe it's let up enough. I, it'll let me do it. I laid down and about, oh, 20 minutes later, it started again. I was like, no. I jumped up and sat in my chair, all right, and yeah, worked on my foot, just trying to get it to release. And then around, oh, three o'clock, I imagine, three, four o'clock, a blue spot of sun cloud, or, or a blue sky peeked through the clouds, right? And it got bigger and bigger, and the pressure released from my foot more and more, right? So it's not feel too, it's still tight, but not nothing compared to what it was earlier and to last night. So it had to do with pressure. It had to do with standing on my feet for two hours straight, right? Because it's something I'm not used to. And I was thinking about how all this started, right? And it has to do with my sciatic. Because I remember when I was 38, I fell asleep on a remote control and I woke up in the morning at, or in the horizon and I tried to get out of bed and I fell on the floor. My left side was in pain. I was seized up. I was stuck on the floor. My husband at the time had to pick me up. Right? Do you know what I mean? So it's, yeah, I'm just trying to figure it out. But I'm glad it's gone. It's eased up. I really am. I had a rough night, a rough day and a rough night. So that's the reason why I didn't make a video, okay? And I didn't get the Schumann post. I didn't see the Schumann posted Saturday or Sunday. 
so I didn't put it down but today it got posted at 53 so that's an 8 I guess we just went through some weird planet phases and moon phases or conjunctions and moon phases or moon alignments and all that too right with uh, Chiron and Saturn or the energy of Capricorn right so maybe that had something to do with whatever energy they were pumping out with those things you know I noticed too on YouTube there hasn't been any news on YouTube in about a week right they're not talking about nothing because they put stuff on there they want you to pay attention to and nothing's come up I wonder what that is I wonder what they're up to so you always gotta keep your eyes on the enemy right yeah they're awfully quiet for some reason well, you know what I mean yeah I was reading disclosure news today too and a whole bunch of stuff being come out I guess Israel started uh, that fake meat the plant-based meat in their country right so they're going to make all their people all the people over there sick because yeah that stuff causes cancer and stuff like this right so we're not meant to eat fake food we're really not and what uh, Bill Gates was one that has something to do with it too so you know it's not any good you know what I mean there's a bunch of crap like that on it right just pointing out the bad guys right so it's being told you know it is same as stuff's being allowed on Facebook and Instagram that wasn't before it would get you thrown in, jail, in Facebook jail right for sure so I know things are better just by that alone Remember, we were supposed to be all locked up in camps, the unvaccinated, that is. You know? And we're not. So that in itself tells you something. Same as, what is it, June 3rd, I think? Is it the 3rd or the 5th of June? There's supposed to be five planets in line with the moon and the sun. Or together it makes five of them. And if you look up at the night sky, they said you could see it. Right? I never see anything from here because they usually cloud up the skies. Motherships be hanging around all the time. Why? I don't know. Hopefully they're picking up the bad, their people, the bad guys, right? For sure. I say that a lot too, for sure. Right? What am I, a valley girl or something? <laughs> no, I'm just strange. Weird. In a wonderful way. Okay. You got a problem with it? Hmm? Do you? I know, I'd be a weird, right? I am. Um, my ears started ringing loud today in the rising. As soon as I got up, I heard it. Right? So, to me, that's the sign of the Shuma being high so far. My trees, we are too, right? Leaves just came out on it, and I noticed the other day, I looked, yesterday I looked, and there's brown spots on the leaves. And then the wood came up, and blue and all these leaves came off so it must have something to do with the magnetic poles switching or whatever or the weather right I don't know but it's different they gotta make it look like it's a biblical prophecy right they do so I'd be seeing all kinds of weird stuff but I know my my audience are all pretty smart people well, you wouldn't be watching me, so you probably know what they're up to, right? You just use your intuition, ask your higher self. Same as at the uh, holistic fair yesterday, I was talking to this one woman, she was a psychic. Well, I talked to a couple people, actually. But this one woman, she was a psychic, right? And she was, uh, I don't know, she had a bunch of cards, like uh, tarot cards, and she was getting people, you could pick one, and she'd tell you what it meant kind of thing. It was like a mini read, whatever, right? And so my sister and her friend did it and everything. And I looked at the woman and I told her, I said, I'm, I'm a psychic, right? I'm quite, you know, quite good or quite strong at it, right? And I haven't had no training or anything. She was mentoring for this other psychic card reader, right? And I said, I know all this stuff and so much more. And I picked up a card. I said, I'll try a card. She goes, yeah. So I put my hand over and I waited till I felt one heat up. 
right? Because that's how I pick crystals too. Picked that a card and I pointed it or turned it around to her. I didn't even look at it. I turned it around to her and it said, you got this. You know what I mean? Like, you're worthy, you're deserving, you know what you're doing, you got this. And I said, and she goes, she said, she told me what it was, right? I turned it around and said, yep, see, I knew it, right? I said, you want me to put it back? She goes, yeah, all right. And so I stood there and I chatted her up for a little bit and told her some things and she told me her problems, right? Because that's what people do. They confess, right? I give her a little bit of, of, of advice, you know? And hopefully, you know, I made her happy. And then I went on my way, right? That's just weird. I need a teacher. I do. Not very many people. I haven't found anybody yet. But maybe it's not, I'm not meant to do that. I have to do this all alone. I had never fit into groups, right? Like, I hear their chatter too much. And it's just, I explained it to my son earlier. He knows exactly what I'm talking about, right? I don't want to explain it right now. Maybe I'll save it for another video another day. But yeah. I hope you're staying, keeping your vibes high. Right? Even though I was in extreme icky sensations for the last, oh, I don't know what, 18 to 20 hours. 18 to 20 hours, I still kept my vibration high the whole time, right? I kept on telling myself, I'm in good health. I have good health. I am, you know, strong. I'm courageous. I'm brave. I just tell myself good affirmations, right? Until I break down and I start to cry and because it was so much pain, right? I was, I had, I asked my son to come in and push on my back and pull my, my feet right and he was like kind of annoyed about it because yeah, i think he was having a hard day time too right but i said you have to i got n nothing else to do i can't take it anymore i just can't fucking take it and he was like all right all right and i'm crying you know not in front of him but i'm just like i just can't fucking take it anymore i knew i had to take it right i do it's like torture right <laughs> you know what i mean but i'm glad it's over i hope it's over Right, I do, for a time being. My poor old body and my mind need a rest from that crap. See, the low pressure system does not help at all either, right? To cure myself, I need a hyperbaric chamber. I do. And that would fix me. But not just anybody get to have those now, do they? Or to use them. So, I just have to wait for this stupid conflict to get on it, to get over with, and then get into the healing the new technology for the healing modalities unless some miracle happens and just poof, one day I wake up and it's brand new I don't know right I'm just trying to think outside of the box that's all folks that's all I sound like Bugs Bunny now that's all folks all right remember that cartoon all right that's enough I didn't have a lot to talk about. I just wanted to give you an update on why I didn't make a video yesterday. Okay? Yeah. It's supposed to start raining throughout the night and all day tomorrow, too. So hopefully it won't affect me too bad. If I can keep this left side of me, you know. I've been telling myself, too, you know. I release the, the karma from my ancestors. You know, I release my trauma, all this, right? I've been seeing stuff every time I close my eyes, though, too. Answers have been coming to me. Different people come up and tell me stuff. And it's just stuff from the past, right? I'm like, do you remember when this happened? And stuff like that, right? It's weird. But, yeah. All right. That's enough before I just start acting silly. I love you all as a consciousness. Enjoy your night or day. Okay? Okay, bye.